Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Well, maybe you should try a wooden push-pull stick. Hi, I'm Chris, and welcome to the Thronemaker Workshop. I decided to use a 1x4 poplar board I have had for a while. I cut off a 16 inch piece and drew on a quick design. All I need is a bird's mouth, a hook, and a handhold. As I cut with a jigsaw, I am trying to cut as close to the line as I can because I know later I'm going to sand to that line. When making the hook, I drill a 5 8 inch hole first, then I can cut out the rest of the hook later. But before I do that, I decide to sand down the edges and the corners to the line. Now it's time to cut out the little places for your fingers. This part takes a little finesse. I'm using a straight edge bit in order to cut down to the line and smooth the finger holds. Now it's time to cut the hook out the rest of the way. I'm using the router to smooth out the hook and also the bird's mouth. That router sure makes a lot of burn marks, so I'm going to have to sand it all away. Sometimes it takes several different methods to get rid of the burn marks. It's time to soften those edges, so I use a 1 roundover round over bit in my router. There are some places that the round over bit can't get to, so it's time to give it a little bit of love and sand it by hand. And the last step is to drill out the hole for the leather cord. Well, I like the shape of this. This is quite cool. This is the part you push your rack in and then you hook your rack this way. Fairly long, 18 inches, and that way that you don't feel the heat so bad. And it'll make it easier to get to the stuff that's inside the oven. I've always wanted to have these, and this is not mine. So I'm going to have to make another one for myself. Later, I'm going to be covering this with uh, mineral oil, and I'm going to put a leather strap on this. The mineral oil will uh, be a little bit of protection and the leather strap is so that uh, my uh, client will be able to hang it up on the wall or uh, wherever she wants to put it. And uh, I asked her if she wanted me to be able to hang it or uh, if she wanted to be able to put it in a drawer. I think this is a little bit long to go into the side of a drawer, um, but uh, uh, it can be shortened. I mean, no problem in shortening it. Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven? Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? What? Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? What? Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Oh my goodness. Why can't I just do this? Tired of burning your hands on a hot hot oven rack, and maybe you should try a wooden push pull, push pull stick. Tired of burning your hands on a blah, blah, blah. Tired of 
burning your hand so that. Tired of burning your hand? Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? No. Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Well, maybe you should try a wooden push pull stick. Tired of burning your hands on a. Tired of burning your hands on a. You know, this is where I waste all my time. Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Well, maybe you should try a push-pull stick. Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Well, maybe you should try a wooden push-pull stick. I'm Crip. Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Well, maybe you should try a wooden put a little put bit 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 bit. Yeah. Take one billion. <laughs> Tired of burning your hands. Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Well, maybe you should try a wooden push pull stick. Hot and black, black bear, black bear, black. Tired of burning your hands on a hot oven rack? Well, maybe you should try a wooden push-pull stick. Hi, I'm Chris, and welcome to the Thronemaker Workshop.